so if you want to make a Polaroid effect, just uh, go to camera.com, search for a Polaroid template. Uh, I'm assuming you want something like this. Uh, yeah, and just, just find a template you like, click on customize. Uh, then you can add like more pages if you want to. Let's just keep one. Uh, go to uploads and upload your own files, your own image. Uh, I have a cat, so I'm just gonna use the cat. Uh, yeah, and just once you have it, just drag and drop it on top of the existing image, and that's it basically. Uh, you can also like uh, go to elements and search for rip paper and stuff like that. Uh, Uh, ripped photo, ripped. Yeah, that 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 doesn't something like this. Nope. Yeah, just make sure you don't drop it on top of the image because it gets replaced. The point is, you want to make it seem like the picture is ripped and uh, it, it's old, so. Uh, yeah, you can just go add like grain and all kinds of effects. Uh, you can also go to photo and search for filters and uh, make adjustments. Uh, let's see, we can find some vintage filters, something like this, so that it looks old. Uh, you can also like adjust the intensity. I mean, this is a bad picture, but whatever. Uh, to I don't know if you want to add text, just add it, double click, rename it, replace it, delete it, uh, do whatever you want, pretty much. But um, yeah, so that's that's how you make a Polaroid design from a template, I guess. Uh, if you don't want like a, the Polaroid to be visible, uh, so. Uh, I mean, you can just search for. I mean, you can just get the picture uh, and uh, just don't keep any. Don't. Okay, so let me let me just try to rephrase what I'm trying to say. Uh. So if you don't want the Polaroid right to be visible, like in the sense that it's the the old Polaroid is in like on the bed or like whatever it is. Uh, but you want the same effect, right? You want to give the effect that your image is old and ripped and stuff like that. Uh, I mean, it's the same principle. Just open a blank page, add your image, uh, and then just go ahead and edit photo, add the vintage effect, add... Uh, I mean, this is an, an illustration, so it's not going to look exactly like you want, but... Uh, the point is, it's the, it's the same way, right? Old. Uh, you can search for some grain. Uh, something like this. I mean, this is probably... I mean, you want it to be white. Uh, you can make it more transparent, stuff like that. Yeah, you can play around with the settings until you have, have a style that you basically like and it looks like it's old. Uh, yeah, so that's that's how you do like a Polaroid effect or you can just simply use a Polaroid template and uh, just drop your image into it and that's it basically.